and with me and Cuck being in the house, I think it was more so the area that we were filming in. We were filming in Panama City Beach. We were filming on the Panhandle. It's nicknamed the Redneck Riviera. Okay, so you can already, you know, <laughs> gist of, you can already get a gist of just kind of like how that experience is gonna be. Um, and I just it it was it was hard for me the first two seasons. Um, I just could not. It was really just it was really hard to film for the first two seasons. Still in the comments. Hey, Nilsa. <laughs> um, yeah. So and look, Nilsa can assess. Like it was just really hard for me the first couple of seasons. I really felt uncomfortable just in that area in general. It was um. You know, it's always a lot, it's always a little bit harder to party in an area. And then, like, um, I think that when you go inside the bars, like, some of the bars that we're going in, I'm not going to say the names. Well, I will say Uglies, because we're banned from Uglies anyway, so forget them. But, you know what I'm saying, when it comes to Uglies, Coyote Uglies, going inside places like that and um, having to party and, you know, get drinks and, you know, seeing Confederate flags everywhere, seeing, um, you know, pro you know, the pro-traditional Southern heritage photos everywhere, you know what that means, and me being Black and a woman, that in itself was just a lot to deal with. Um, and then, like, I'm seeing them, and, you know, it was just, it was hard. And I can honestly say one person that was very sensitive to it was, um, you know, with the girls in the house. Um, you know, with my girls that's still there now, um, uh, you know, Amy and Nilsa, like, I remember I told Nil uh, Amy about it, and Amy was like, well, girl, we can go home if you want to. Because I remember I sat at the bar, and I'm looking at all of these Confederate flags, like, on the wall. And it's just, like, it's hard to be in those types of environments and act like you don't see it. So let me ask you this. So let me ask you this. Do you feel like the producers of the show should have done a little bit better, a better job of vetting these places before putting you in an uncomfortable situation to be filmed? What I will say with that is that the producers of the show wasn't aware. They was not aware that, you know, they didn't think about it. I can honestly say that's one thing that I think went over all of their head is that, oh, we have black people on this show, but the bars that we're partying at, like the symbolism that's inside of these bars and, you know, maybe how they're treated inside of the bars as far as trying to get a drink versus other people. Because, I mean, little things like that I had, you know, issues with. And so it's just some, there were certain things like that that was unfortunately beyond production couldn't really do anything about it they still had to make a show and so um and there were yeah there were just a lot of moments that was uncomfortable not because of the producers of the show but because of just where we was filming it and that was the story that they wanted to tell they wanted to tell the story of eight kids that were partying in this area and you know that panhandle area but that the area has just traditionally and historically been known to not be friendly to all people and so um, and that's not everybody. It's just, it was just certain bars and you go in and you would see certain things. Like, La Viva was already very wonderful and kind to us. Shout out to No Name. No Name Bar was so amazing to all of us. Um, you know, Shore Dogs, they were great. It was just a, it was just always, it was just, it's only a few bars that, that was just like, I was like, mm, I don't feel comfortable here. And so, well, we ended up um, transitioning over to St. Pete for season three. Um, St. Pete was incredible. Incredible. Like St. Pete, I can't tell you how much fun I had there. And I didn't even know what St. Pete was on the map, but you know, it was it was fun. And St. Pete was so progressive and they were so welcoming of us. And so um I would say that I wouldn't even give it so much more as an area thing, but it was more so just this you just you it's just certain people and certain bars. You know what I'm saying? 